Hello guys, and welcome to another night NASCAR Diecast Review. Today's review is going to be on the 2017 Grey Golding Dr. Pepper car. Um, so let's get out of the box. Grey Golding 23, BK Racing, render of the car, 2017 standard finish. They made a total of 409 on the lower side. Grey Golding. 17, back top, yeah, weird enough they don't have a picture of him right here, so that's weird, but here's the car, I did chassis swap this car, if you saw my had a chassis swap video, this car is chassis swapped, so I like it much, a lot more, so let's get to how it looks, got the Toyota front, the second best looking car in NASCAR. First is the Camaro. Got side. The reason I bought this car is because I love the sponsor. I love Dr. Pepper. It's the best soda out there. I don't care what anybody says. But yes, this is a great car. So let's get to the engine detail. Opens up very well, actually. Why couldn't all the hoods open up like this? There's engine detail, your plastic block. Now look at that. You got Dr. Pepper and Toyota underneath the hood. And then the trunk opens. Sorry, I had to adjust. My legs were going numb. Um, hood opens. Main trunk opens, deck lid, got your rookie stripes, the roof flaps do open, which is very nice. Let's get out the sponsors, Dr. Pepper, established 1885. What I don't understand is Dr. Pepper allows Monster on their car, but Pepsi, which has a very tiny logo on the Hendrick cars, won't let it on their car. Doesn't make any sense. As you can see on this Chase Elliott Hooters car, there's one Mountain Dew logo, and it's right there. You can you barely notice it, and they won't allow Monster on their car. But this car is wrapped head to toe in Dr. Pepper, and Monster can be on their car. So another reason why I like Dr. Pepper more than Pepsi. So, sponsor, Dr. Pepper, the one you crave, Dr. Pepper, 21 means 21, so he is under 21, at the roof, the one you crave, Golding, he never ran this car, uh, they had this car, but someone else was driving it, I don't remember who was driving it, but it wasn't him, so, that's a little weird, um, you got Schultzer Systems, the one you crave, Camry, Toyota, XSE, 23, the rookie stripe, because he's a rookie. And then the same on the other side. So, if you want to get this car, I would highly recommend it, because it's a pretty good looking paint scheme. Uh, this car might dry up a little bit, because it, there were only 400 produced, and the smaller teams usually go up pretty quickly. And it's a pretty good die cast. I would highly recommend it, especially if you chassis swap it. It makes it five times it makes it ten times better. Cause it just comes with a plastic body that no one likes. The suspension works. Oh. Suspension works. The front kind of works. So yeah. If you get this car, I would recommend chassis swapping it. But um yeah, that's all I have to say. So this has been a review of the 2017 Grey Golding Dr. Pepper car. Thank you for watching.